As COVID cases continue to climb across our area, doctors are stressing the importance of taking precautions. But since COVID symptoms can sometimes appear the same as seasonal allergies, how can you know the difference? Brent Solomon checked in with experts to help you sort it out. Brent. Hey there, Ann. We all have to be careful to protect ourselves and others. Doctors say that includes people who suffer from allergies who may just think, I always have symptoms this time of year. Those symptoms could be a sign of something bigger. Dandelions, flowers in bloom, sights of summer on the way. Yet for some, it can be downright miserable. I run outside a lot and it makes it difficult to exercise because no matter how much uh, medication I take, the symptoms are still pretty bad. That's because he suffers from seasonal allergies. It means a lot of coughing. Everything, but especially my eyes, uh, difficulty breathing sometimes. Sound familiar? That's because COVID can trigger the same reaction. You can have sneezing with COVID, but it's just more common with uh, allergies. I caught up with Dr. Joe Brunworth of SSM Health, St. Louis University Hospital, to help you know the difference. The nasal congestion and stuffiness can be found in both. But if you have, you know, a really bad sore throat and you feel sick, um, like you can't get out of bed and those sorts of ill symptoms are more what I would think of with COVID. Since symptoms can be so similar, he says those with allergies have to pay close attention to what your body is telling you. If you had loss of sense of smell and taste and you kept breathing through your nose fine, then I'd think, okay, you might want to get tested for COVID. But if you think the reason you're losing your sense of smell is because you're so completely congested that you can't smell or uh, breathe in at, through your um, nose, then it might just be your allergies. Knowing the differences can help not only with your own peace of mind, but also when you have to explain your symptoms to those around you. I just now you're like, just allergies. That's what everyone says, but uh, it really is. All right, Dr. Bonworth says regardless, it's still a good idea to take COVID precautions, distancing yourself from others, wearing a mask around people and getting vaccinated. What seems like a minor symptom for you could be significant for someone else if, in fact, COVID is the cause. Workers in Illinois